Pig farm anaerobic digestion hog manure, as excreted, contains approximately 90% moisture and 7% biodegradable volatile solids. The net biogas yield for each hog is reported to be around 3.2 cubic feet per day. The most common AD technologies for treating swine manure, we believe, typically covered lagoons and complete mix CSTR systems. Swine manure digesters will need to be relatively large in comparison to the amount of organic matter added. Pork producers normally overcome this barrier by using high-rate digesters, or accepting a comparatively large proportion of food waste. Manure from hogs is wetter than that from cattle, sheep, horses, and poultry. On hog farms, the anaerobic digestion process must be designed to reduce HRT hydraulic retention time while maintaining SRT solids retention time long enough to sustain the microbial communities. This is what drives the need for high-rate digesters. Digesters such as fixed film reactors, the anaerobic sequencing batch reactor ASBR, and upflow anaerobic sludge blanket UASB types are reported to work well with dilute hog manure. High-rate UASB reactors with hydraulic retention times as short as two hours can reportedly be used for anaerobic digestion of particle-rich supernatant from cow and pig manure. But, pig manure contains a lot of ammonia. This could be a problem in anaerobic treatment because high ammonia concentrations can inhibit methanogenesis, resulting in low biogas yields. So, pig farm owners who decide to embark upon biogas projects will need to seek out the very best expert advice, and be willing to invest in technology unfamiliar to most biogas plant operators.